Hey guys, what's going on? So I wanted to do a quick review on this uh, Hydro Flask that I, I got. So I've had this for a couple years now and uh, I'm just gonna tell you my honest thoughts about it. Okay, so I also have an Iron Flask and I have an Arctic, uh, an Arctic water bottle. It's like a gallon one, but um, I've done another review on that so I'll include a link to that as well. So for this, um, I'm gonna be straight up honest with you, 100% honest. I like it. I think it does a better job than a non-water bottle. Uh, sorry, than a non, <laughs> than a non-water bottle, than a non uh, like cooling one or whatever, like one of those these temperature ones. But I think it's the least good of the three. Um, I don't think it does as good of a job as the uh, Iron Flask or the Arctic Flask. Um, so I got this. It was a, it was on a Black Friday a couple years ago, and it was. Uh, so it was like a lot cheaper. This I think is the most expensive of the three, but also in my opinion, it works the least good of the three. It still works well, but it does not work as well as the others. Um, from my experience, I thought that I could fill this up with ice. Um, I, I got this one because I wanted to be able to put it, it's smaller and I wanted to be able to put it in the uh, water bottle holder and on my on my bike when I go riding. Um, I live in a pretty uh, pretty desert climate um, and it's one of the driest states and this does not uh, really stand up to that like I thought I could leave ice in it put it in the sun for like an hour or two or something like that and it would come back and it would like the ice would be there so be cold that has not been my experience it just doesn't do that that great of a job so if it were me uh, if I could do it again I would not buy this one I would buy, I would actually buy the iron flask that one has been awesome awesome um, so um, the other thing is I think this is the most expensive. I think they have the best branding. Sorry, I know I've got that like dumb sticker on there, but um, but I think they've got the best branding. I think that's people know them. And they're willing to pay more for it. Iron Flask, I believe, is is cheaper a little bit. And I, when I say cheaper, I just mean less expensive. I don't mean less good quality. I think it's actually better. But this is just one that isn't hasn't been my favorite. Um, whenever I've used it, I, I've been disappointed. I haven't, now to be 100% honest, I have not used it with hot things like a soup or a hot chocolate or something like that. Um, I primarily use it to keep things cold and I've, always, I've just been disappointed with it. Now it works a lot better than a regular water bottle that isn't insulated, but I don't think that it does a great job in keeping things cold compared to the other brands. So um, if it were me, if I, if I could do it again, I, I wouldn't buy this one. Um, I don't know, maybe I'm doing something wrong. Maybe my expectations are unrealistic but that's, that's what I think about it. So um, let me know what you guys think if you have any questions in the comments or anything. Um, but yeah, if I could do it again, I wouldn't get this one. Thanks for watching, see you next time.